the men's open H doubles final on the water right now. A full, full slate in all eight lanes. Fuller and Fuller from the Catawba Yacht Club in lane one. Bird and Hayes from Willamette in lane two. Spencer and Arnold from Capital in lane three. In lane four, it's Schley and Saw, Shaw from Saugatuck. Say that three times fast. Anderson and Siddick from uh, Detroit in lane five. Lane six has Anderson and Borschelp from Texas. In lane seven, Gilliland and Gilliland, the heroes movement. Great showing in the heat. Uh, Trockley and Tannhauser from Newport Sea Base Composite. They had a fine showing in the heats as well. On the water and coming down the course here at Eagle Creek. We can see that Anderson and Siddick from Detroit uh, appear to be out in the lead right now. Open water over the uh, Schley and Shaw from Saugatuck. But meanwhile, the... Uh, Trying to see the number on that boat. I think that might be uh, Willamette there in the foreground. That's uh, in third, battling for that with the Heroes movement. Uh, actually, it's uh, the Newport Sea Base composite on the outside lane, it looks like. They're battling for third right now. Not far out of the hunt is Texas, Anderson and Borschelt there in lane six. Again, an interesting shakeup from uh, in progression between the heats and the finals. Sometimes, sometimes the heats are really telling of what the spread may be, and sometimes it's like a box of matches and sticks. You just throw it up in the air, and something crazy happens. But the fastest crew uh, coming into this was Sagatuck. And it does look like that that it's the Detroit boat out in front. So even though they didn't have the fastest time, they were behind actually by about five seconds in the heats. They seem to have had uh, some of the tank that they were reserving for this afternoon. Maybe they had one of those smash burgers at the food truck. Yeah. Who knows? Yes. But yes, they are really pouring it on right now. Schley and Shaw from Saugatuck in hot pursuit, as is the Newport Sea Base composite. You know, it kind of appears that a few of these people may have been holding a little back for the race today, mm -hmm. or the finals today. But as they come to the line, it is the boat from uh, Detroit crossing first, then the Saugatuck, just barely beating out the Newport Sea Base composite. Willamette there crossing the line just uh, in time with the boat from Capital, it appeared. Oh, no, Capital was coming across there. The Heroes movement right behind them. There goes the Heroes movement across the line and then rounding it out the Catawba Yacht Club here, Fuller and Fuller crossing the line here. The men's open H double final. Congratulations to Detroit, Anderson and Setic or Cytec. Time of 404.34, Saugatuck behind them. Trockley and Tannhauser from Newport Sea Base Composite in third. Nice showing from them. Willamette then in fourth. Texas fifth, Capital sixth. And the Heroes Movement in seven with Saugatuck, or the Catawba Yacht Club, rounding out the men's Open H double final. 